seam bowlers to be used. So far, Malcolm, De Freitas and Lewis. And Paul Jarvis is going to take over from Philip De Freitas, whose figures at the moment are five overs, no maidens, none for 23. And well bowled, that's a good start and out. Been at Cambly has gone, immediate success for Paul Jarvis. That's the sort of change that all captains like to make, and there's the breakthrough. As Cambly once again playing uh, without really moving his feet. That's been uh, his weakness. And you can see over here, his feet have hardly moved. He's just gone through with that shot and a very simple catch to the wicketkeeper, Stewart. Well, Alex Stewart makes no mistake. It's 61 for two. It'd be worth a gamble for a couple of overs. Oh, that's a very good shot. He's out. He's LBW. Oh. Umpire Ramaswamy has given him out. Well, my goodness, what a wicket that is for England. Well, it was beautifully bowled by Jarvis. A little bit of an in-swinger there. Just drifted in. But I just wonder if Azarudin played at that ball with his pad outside off stump. I think he got outside off stump. And if he had then he's very unlucky to be given out because he shouldn't be out if he's played a shot and he's outside off stump. Look at that pad where it hits him, he's outside off stump for me. Got him! Brilliant catch by Hick and Emery's gone and Jarvis has done it again! Well, what more can you ask for? Graham Hick is simply magnificent at slip. Anything that flies anywhere near him is just like catching pigeons. Amre again goes for the big shot just outside off stump there. Jarvis has finally tempted him just to just once too often. And India are now 100 for five. And here comes Jarvis to Kapaldev. Oh, and that's a good one straight through Kapaldev. He's letting on that he left it, but I'm not sure he did. Oh, that's a pretty good one. Yes, he's out. He's gone. On path. Yeah, Ramaswamy has his finger up, Kieran Moray is out, LBW Bell Jarvis for naught, and that is the seventh wicket. Well, Kieran Moray's foot was not quite to the mark, he was neither forward nor back, he was in the crease, the ball nipping back, you can see he's neither gone forward nor back, that's a clear-cut LBW decision for umpire Ramaswamy. 115 for seven. Oh, it's that was a very good Yorker by Jarvis. He can't believe that umpire Ramaswamy won't give it out. It might have been, I suppose, just outside the line of the off stump that he'd hit Kumle on the boot. It was a pretty good one. Yes, I think it was a very, very good Yorker. And there's the tenth. Paul Jarvis wraps up this game for England. Kumble is the man, the final man out for India. Jarvis caps a very good day personally for himself and turns it into a very good day for England. Yes, the most memorable parts of the day have been Srinam bowling for India. Five wickets and five for Paul Jarvis, who's bowled a similar spell of pretty lively...